Aloha and happy April. This is our first Tuesday of April 2021. This is Halao Kū no Ike Kai, and I'm Kumu Kanoi. I'm the Kumu Hula of this Hula school, and this is actually our home here in Nu'uanu Valley on the island of Oahu. That was the view that you got just a second ago, was the view down the valley right here on the main island of, of um, Oahu. And uh, we're, we're not too far from town for those of you who haven't been here before. And yeah, we are getting ready, gearing up all month long to my personal favorite day of the entire year. And that is Lei Day. Here in Hawaii, Lei Day is May 1st. And I always feel like it goes by too quickly. So I decided for the entire month of April, we're going to be gearing up towards May Day. So if you get sick of it, sorry, but it'll be over after May 1. Um, and yeah, so without any further stretching out, I believe it is time. Aloha. That means greetings with regards. I am so happy that you folks have decided to join us for Hula this evening. We meet here every Tuesday evening. Right now in Hawaii, it is just after 5 p.m. Hawaii time. I know that there are so many of you joining from all over the world. I just got a message from one of our dancers that said, Kumu, it's 11 o'clock where I live and I don't think I'm going to be able to stay up. So no worries, Yvonne. I know you're watching this on the replay. And if you are also watching the replay, aloha to you. We do want to say aloha to all of our friends who are joining us from literally all over the world. That's one of the, the positives about this COVID. It has um, opened our doors, uh, our virtual Facebook live doors. To so many of you so i want to say aloha to some of our friends of course uncle frank and auntie mary joining us from california aloha our, our ohana there sharon oh you caught me i know that's my new tag tagline Hooey. aloha so aloha sharon in halava lehua i think lehua is still in oh she's back lehua is back welcome home lehua back in kahalu'u fred Fred is joining us, oh, in Las Vegas. Okay, everybody's on the move. I guess people are traveling. Fred is in uh, in Vegas. Wendy says Ni Hao, but I don't think that she's in Ni Hao land. I think she's in St. Louis Heights over there, uh, right uh, on, the, on the hill up there. And let's see, oh my gosh, all of the, the, the things are rolling in. So I might, I, I'm sorry if I miss you. Oh, I see Rosalinda. She's a little bit further down Florida. It's 11 p.m. there. Thanks for staying up. I don't know if you are already up, but I appreciate you being here. Fern is joining us from the Lone Star State. Is that what it's called? Lone Star from Texas. Yeah, very good. Okay, I, I'm sure I missed some. Oh, Barbara. Barbara is on the uh, Moko Keave, also known as the Big Island, Island of Hawaii. She's in Kona, so good to see you, Barbara. Jamie, I'm not sure where Jamie is, but Jamie, aloha no. Sorry, I, it'll take me a few times to get everybody straight. Well, more than a few times, right? Christina is in San Diego. I always forget that one. Christina, aloha in San Diego. Linda in Pennsylvania. Panoy in Massachusetts. Petra, checking in from Germany. You go, you go, Petra. And Christine, Aloha in Australia. Well, if that doesn't just make you want to pick up a glass and cheers, man, what an awesome group we have. Um, and I know that we'll have more people joining us on the replay because everyone is getting very excited for what's to come, which is, of course, our lay day. Now, before we get into our hula, I just wanted to do a few little commercial kind of things. 
So if you follow us here on Facebook, you may have seen some of the posts, but you may have been missing some of them because we are also now posting quite regularly to Instagram. So if you want to follow us, it's Instagram, uh, Napuahala, same like our normal halal name. And we're doing a challenge that we created ourselves. Like who makes more work for them? This kumu right here makes so much more work for myself than I need. But I just, I'm having so much fun. Like I said, May 1st is known as Lay Day here in Hawaii. And it was a, a day that was sort of invented um, in more recent times. I'll tell you more history maybe another time. But I always feel that May Day, Lay Day, comes and goes too quickly. So I decided for the entire month of April, I was going to make lay, wear lay, and give lay um, every day as much as possible. So um, I wanted to show you some of the lay that we've made. I think it's, today's the sixth. And here are the six lay that I have presented. And then if you count the one that I'm wearing, I guess this is seven. So maybe you'll see this one on Instagram tomorrow. But you see, um, most of these are lay that I have either made or that I have in my collection. I wanted to point out this one right here. I did not make this fantastic lay. This lei comes to us from the city and county of Honolulu's lei competition in 2018. Now, that is a competition that is uh, near and dear to my heart because I am a former lei queen. And uh, that was way, way back, 2009, city and county of Honolulu lei queen. I know we also have some of our lei princesses right here on the live with us. So make sure to give a aloha no to Princess Sharon and Princess Whitney. If they are here, and if any of you folks are city and county former lay queens or princesses, let us know because um, it's just it's kind of like a little sorority that we're all belong to this this lay sorority. Oh, we should have that. Anyways, okay, I digress. Anyways, if you would like to jump in on this, you don't have to do every single day of lay, um, but I do invite you to try out making a lay. Maybe practice now so that on May Day. We all hopefully have to make a lay, share a lay, and wear a lay. So if you would like to participate in our challenge, follow us on Facebook and Instagram. I think we have social media. Yes, hashtag, hashtag, <laughs> hashtag lays for days. And just go ahead and, and tag that lays for days. And hopefully we can gather a whole bunch of lay leading up to May 1st to celebrate that. Okay, so. Enough talking for now. I think it's time to hula. We're going to jump into May Day is Lay Day in Hawaii. Now, if you already come to the Saturday class, I apologize, but I need to teach the chorus one more time today just to get everybody up to speed because some people don't do the Saturday class. Some people only do the Tuesday class. So if you need to, oop, a bug just kind of attacked me. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so... If, if you need to just sit back and, and watch this one more time, um, let's do that. But on Tuesdays, because some of my more uh, our more advanced dancers come on Tuesday, there's going to be a special surprise that we're going to add after you have mastered the chorus of May Day is Lady. It's a little hint. Okay, so here are the words to May Day is Lady. It was written by a couple. They're known as Leonard Red and... What is that? Do you see that thing? It's like dive bombing. It's not little. It's. I want to come close to the video so you guys can see. When it lands, it's like my whole body goes. Doom. Okay, no. <laughs> There's some sort of animal attacking me. If I pass out, grab an EpiPen and send it to me through that. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not allergic. Okay, anyways. It was written by a couple. <laughs> Leonard, Red, Hawk, and his wife, Ruth. Hawk. And uh, this is the famous, the famous one that we do every time for May Day. Uh, everybody learned this in grade school, and we're going to do it again. So here we go. Hands straight out in front of you. I'll go through this quickly, I promise. You're going to make a little tiny M shape for May Day. And then you're going to connect your fingers right in the center, lift them up over your head, is Lay Day, and come right to the chest level. In Hawaii, 
For this one, the right hand is going to extend to the 45 degree angle. Left hand is just straight up and down. Look beyond the fingers and then switch to the other side. Hawaii. Okay, so let's try that one more time. Mayday, go. Mayday, up is Lady in Hawaii. Then for garlands of flowers, you're going to use your wrist as a guide. That's it. And you're going to pick flowers down and up. Looking at your hands, of course, not staring at the computer. And you're going to go to the other 45. Flowers everywhere. On where? You're going to show them off to the right. And then back over to the left. Again, keeping your fingers, your hands rather, pretty tight to one another. Don't let them open real wide like this. See if you can stay like that. From the beginning, little M shape. Ready, go. Mayday lay. Is lay day in Hawaii. Pick flowers to the right. Garlands left. A flowers everywhere. And drag it back left. Now all of the colors in the rainbow, you're going to touch your right fingertips right into the left palm. And draw the rainbow. Paint it right across the sky. All of the colors in the rainbow, you're going to dip both hands down and then a nice round rainbow overhead in the rainbow okay so here we go uh, all of the colors touching the palm all of the colors in the rainbow then maidens is going to be a body motion so you can be as curvy or as straight as as you are or as you'd like to be maybe maidens with blossoms in their hair i actually have leaves in my hair but oh well and other hair that's it okay let's go all the way from the beginning are you singing with me you better be singing don't leave me hanging mayday go mayday is lady in hawaii pick flowers to the right garland of flowers everywhere touch in the palm all of the colors dip in the rainbow maidens maidens with blossoms in their hair that's it okay the Last half starts with flowers. That means you're going to pick your hands right out in front of you. I'll come a little closer now. Flowers that mean we should be happy. And then flip it over to the other side. Click, pick out in front. Flowers that mean we should be happy. I love cheese. Okay. Then throwing aside, you're going to lock that left hand into your waist. Right hand is going to be just above eye level, maybe right above head level, actually. Throwing other side. Aside. A load of cares. You're going to scoop in front of you. A load of care. Now, you don't want to lift it too high because you're going to open your hands just above shoulder level and you have a little shrug. Oh. Then back to the beginning. Mayday, put on your lay. Is Lady in Hawaii? Pick uh, M. Mayday is now palms in. Happy, flip out. Days out there. And I think on the recording we said out here. We were wrong. Sorry, Red. Okay. So those are all of the hands. Now I know you're saying, whoa, that was fast that she taught this. Number one, I teach this every year. So if you've been with me all year, weren't you practicing this whole time? I'm just kidding. I know you weren't practicing. Okay. But there are replays of this at a slightly slower pace, especially if you come Saturday, it's a little bit slower. Okay. So just get up and dance. This is what we call almost Kani Kapila style hula. Just press, go give them, no get them. Okay. So we're going to add the feet. And the feet are... Kaholo. You love that kaholo, right? That kaholo is the hula dancer's favorite because when you don't know what to do, kaholo. Okay, so let's do that kaholo. Hands on your waist, bend your knees just slightly. I'm going to lift my hem of my TNL mu'u mu'u. I'll tell you more about that later. Okay, we're going to take four steps to the right and four steps to the left. Let's kaholo just the feet to go right, 
two, three, and left. Two, three, and right. Two, three, and add the hands. Kaholo, right. Kaholo, left. Kaholo, right. Kaholo, here it comes. May they sing with me. Go. May they put on that lay. It's lay day in Hawaii. Garlands of flowers picked to the right. Garlands of flowers. Drag it to the right and back to the left. Draw the rainbow paint. All of the colors. Dip the hands in the rainbow. Maidens. Curvy, maybe. Maidens with blossoms in their hair. Looking away from the hand. Now flowers pick out in front. Flowers that mean smiling should be happy. Throwing aside, shake to the right. Throwing aside a load of care. Shrugging. Oh, Mayday is Lady in Hawaii. Mayday smiling is happy day out there or here or wherever you are okay you can have lady wherever you are too don't have to be only in hawaii okay i don't know why i sang that whole thing because i have a recording but before we go to the recording i want to give you a little catch the breath catch the breath um a little surprise so i reached out to my dear uncle kimo alama keolana and he is just a treasure trove of knowledge of mele and hula and so i told him uncle kimo i once heard that there were verses to mayday's lady not just the thing that we sing but other parts and he said you know i don't know it off the top of my head but let me go see if i have a copy and next week i'm gonna show you the actual music that he sent me he actually had sheet music from the Palace Theater organist. Hello. Um, but here are the verses. I want you to see them. Land of the flowers, of flowery bowers, in her gay dress she appears. A sweet, happy maid. May her dress never fade as she carries this day through the years oh may day is that's how it goes something like that okay anyways i haven't done the recording of the whole verses because i just got them yesterday so isn't that amazing there's another verse wait here look 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 land of green mountains gardens and fountains beaches of white shining sand where each one i see has a smile just for me and has ready a welcoming hand. I forget how that melody part goes. Sorry. Oh, may day. Can I just? I expect to see all the mind blown emojis in the chat because I never knew all these years. Lady is my favorite, and I don't even know the song. Hello. Okay. Anyways, the recording that I have is also lovely because it features my lovely husband, who is behind the camera here. Thank you very much. Baby. And my son, Eames Kalaniakea, who is at Tutu's house. So, just the chorus, two times. Yeah. <gasps> I see Fern was Mayday Queen in sixth grade, Eva Beach Elementary. I would love to see a picture of that, Fern. I just, I'm sure you were a stunning queen. Okay, Mayday's latest, two times through phones. Hula. May day is lay day. Put on your lay. How's that emotion place to the right? Stretch that top hand. Garlands of flowers. Pick to the right. Pick to the left. Drag it across. And other side. All of the colors. Dip the fingers down and then arc over the head. Maiden. Body motion. Give a little wink, wink. Blossoms in their hair, right? Flowers straight out front. Elbows 
Plumerias fall down from the ceiling. Raining plumelia. Okay, how was that? Simple, right? I know. And actually, now that I know there's verses, I'm like, oh, the chorus is kind of boring by itself, you know? You need to sprinkle in that storytelling of the verses. So we will attack the verses next week. So you have to come back. That's it. You just have to come back. Um, now... I want to tell you, what is this for? Because you're probably thinking, gosh, May feels so far away. Why are we going to learn a May Day song and keep practicing it over and over? Well, my darlings, because we're going to have a ho'ike. Do you know what a ho'ike is? Ho'ike is based on the word ike. Ike can mean to see, and it can also mean knowledge. So it's kind of outward and inward. So ike is this word. Now, ho ike is to make seen or to make known. So a ho ike is sort of a performance and in a way it's sort of like a um, assessment. Let's call it assessment, not test, right? But it's like, okay, you've been studying hula with halau na pua hala kuno wikekai for one whole year during COVID. What have you learned, right? So this is what we're going to do. It's not a test. I, I hope I didn't scare any, anybody away. But it's a performance. It's a show. And I love the show. All of my dancers know I love, love, love the show. So we are going to put on a virtual May Day is Lay Day Ho Ike. We have hula on Saturday, May 1st at 9 a.m. And so on uh, Saturday, 9 a.m. of IE time, we're going to broadcast a video of a few of our favorite lay songs that we have learned over the past year. This is one of them. May Day is Lay Day. Of course, we have to do this one. But it's going to have that extra sparkle of the verses that nobody has ever heard before. Not nobody, but you know. Did you ever hear them before? I didn't think so. So anyways, we're going to have May Day is Lay Day is one. The second one. Actually, do we have that slide so that they can see? The second song is Lay Ho'oheno. Lay Ho'oheno is what we're going to cover today. And that is by Weldon Kekaoha, performed by Weldon Kekaoha, written by Kainani, Kainani Kahau Naele. And we have their permission to use their nele. So that is Leho Oheno. And that is a mele that I had taught long before COVID um, to my ladies and have shared with you folks since. So we're going to review it today. I will also point you towards other um, classes uh, that I did earlier this year where you can do it a little bit slower. The next and final melee that you have an opportunity to be a part of is Lei 
Pua Melia, which talks about the plumeria blossom, a lay made out of that yellow and white plumeria, maybe pink and white, maybe, I'm not sure. But anyways, there will be a couple of different ways that you can be a part of it. You can either submit a video, and I'll give you information about that, or, fingers crossed, we're going to try to do a live filming outdoors, very, very spaced out, most likely still with masks, um, but at least we could all be in one place and dancing. Those of you that can make it to Honolulu on Friday, April 23rd from 5 to 7 p.m., okay? So more information about the, the details of how to submit and what to submit and where to go and blah, 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 blah will be forthcoming, but I am going to ask that you maybe write, un, write down this note, and this is the link that I want you to go to. It is tiny, tiny, url.com slash lay day 2021 and i'll put uh, luke will put it into the comments and i will blast it out to the emails and all the thing in my bobs but um all i really want here is just to get an idea of what you might be interested in doing and if you want to write in there and say you know what i don't want to dance anything but i want more information because i want to watch the show then you can do that too but I want to know, you know, who wants to dance what song, who's thinking that they're going to submit videos, and who's thinking that they're going to come to the live. And if you change your mind, no worries, but it's just going to help us to get a little bit of planning happening because April 22nd and May 1st are coming up super duper fast. So please go sign up for that. If you happen to miss the sign up for that, no worries. I'm still going to keep spamming you with this information all day, every day. This just helps me kind of get a gauge. Okay? Let me know if there's any questions in the comments that I can, like, answer. Probably there's nothing I can answer. I have no details right now. So I made it as far as making a form. Fill it out. Okay? Okay. Let's move to Leho Oheno because we got lots to do. Leho Oheno is actually one long song. It's kind of like two chunks. So here are the lyrics. And this is, again, by Kainani Kahaunaele and performed by her dear friend, Weldon Hikawoha. Okay, so for those of you that never learned this before, no worries. This is going to be a fast review because we got to. This is just like if you were to come to Hula and we're reviewing all the songs that everybody already knows. That's kind of what we're doing today. But you can watch the replays over and over and over and you can get it. Yeah. Or you can choose maybe I'm not going to do this Leho Oheno too hard. I'm only going to do Made This Lady. Good. Fantastic. Sounds good. Okay, but hang with us. Let's do this. So we're going to do the first vamp. After kind of a little musical intro, the vamp, of course, is that kaholo that gets us going. You're going to start off with your left hand extended away from your shoulder, and you're going to wave out, and then to the center, then drop it down, and then the right hand raises up, and you go out and center. That vamp is classic, Le Momi Maldonado, my own kumuhula. She loved this vamp. Very simply, side and front, right, Kanoi? Doesn't she love this vamp? This is a classic kahali io kahala vamp. Okay, so let's do the map kaholo to the right. Here we go. Bum, bum, bum. Other side. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, now, aloha, of course, means love. Pili means to be stuck. And ku'u means my. So, e ku'u pili aloha. Oh, my stuck love. You know who my stuck love is? This guy right behind the camera. Can you imagine that we met at Mary Monarch, which would have been this week, 12, 12 years ago. Gosh, aren't we lucky? Aren't we lucky? Yeah, yeah. So when you're talking about your Pili Aloha, it's that person that is stuck with you forever and ever and ever. And maybe you didn't find them yet. One day, maybe. Or maybe not. Who cares? Okay, so here we go. Bring your hands out to the 45-degree angle. And you're going to wave, and you're going to bring it together. So the right hand is going to be on top. Left hand is going to be on the bottom. Sorry to all of you lefties out there. E ku'u pili. I, I don't know what key I'm in. Aloha. On aloha, you're going to take the right hand on top of the left, and you're going to just push it into your center, just like that. Okay, I tried to make this fancy thing, and it's really heavy falling down. Okay. E ku'u pili. And then bring it in. Aloha. Okay. 
Then kuule, my beloved lei. You're going to take the right hand up and over. Kuule, kaupo'o. And then hivi, you're going to touch your shoulders and shoulders. Okay, I have to make sure I'm doing the right side. You know how I get mixed up, right, left, right, left. Okay, so here we go. E kuupili go. E kuupili aloha kuule kaupo'o hivi. That's it. And if you notice, when you put that lei over your shoulders, I mean over your head, it doesn't come down to meet in the center first. It goes right from here, and then your left hand is going to meet it, right? What is happening with this play? Okay, right there. That's what it's going to meet it, right there. And then switch left hand on the top. Okay, one more time. My stuck love, kuupili. And then bring it, push it into yourself. Aloha. Put on that lei. Kuulei. Kau po'ohivi. Po'ohivi are your shoulders. That's it. Now you're going to turn to, oh, let, let's add the feet for that. So you're going to start with hella hella. One of the very few choreography that I've ever done where you start with a hella. But here's what I love about it. You get this holo to the side on the vamp and the holo to the side. And then you get to really dramatically sit into that hella. It just feels very ono like let's start this Mary Monarch boom kanani. Okay. So yes, just like that hella. Just a little bit of aiha aki, an extra bend in the in the knee. Okay, so the hella is gonna go e kuupili. Then to kao, aloha kaholo kuule kaupo hivi. Good. Now there's that left foot turning to the side. So you already know the next one is gonna be an o. Your right foot is gonna cross over. Let me try Vavai Kamen. Okay, so here's another view for you. And I lift my skirt a little bit. So at the end of the kaholo, your left foot is slightly turned out. You're going to shift your way onto that left foot. Your right foot is going to cross over and it's going to go forward and center. Now we're not going to do both sides for this one. We're going to continue to face to the front. Okay, let's just do the feet. Hello, ready? Uh, oh, wait, actually, let's go from the kaholo because we want to see that sit. Kaholo to the right. Two, three, kaholo to the left. Sit down and hella. E kuupili kaosue. Aloha. Kaholo kuule. Kaupo ohivi. Lead it to the left and step. Oh, no, no, ihu holo left. No hea ika maka alcoholo. Iliko ika ua. Kilihu une. Kilipo he ike kani. Ding, 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 ding. Look, my right foot turned out because now we're going to get the rest of that o. Le hua ka o. Right and left. Okay, let's come back to the regular camera so you can see how that looks. Okay. Phew. Let's go from um, the starting vamp, and then when we get to the part where we don't know the hands, then I'll break that in. Okay, ready, kaholo, looking over the hand, very regal, look beyond, you're the mayday queen or the princess at least. Kuupili, kao, aloha, put on your lei, kuule, kaupo'ohivi, turn to the side. Okay, this is the part we're not so sure yet. So now my left hand ended up on top, right hand on the bottom. This left hand is going to swing out to the side, actually all the way to the back. Yeah. Right hand is going to go to your nose, and it's going to be sort of under the nose like this. This is the smell. It's supposed to be flowers, I think, but it smells like chocolate chip cookies to me today. So you're going to go with this. Oh, no, no, kaihu. Okay, so. Whatever that smell is. Then, nohea ika maka. You're going to flip the palms up. Nohea means to be beautiful or handsome. So, whatever applies to you, that's what you are. Yeah, nohea. So, you're going to go, nohea ika maka. That's going to be a kaholo to the left. So, let's just try your kaholo ing away from your hands. Kaholo to the left. Here we go. Nohea ika maka. 
Very good. Can we go all the way from the beginning? Let's just put all of that together. E kuupili. Ready and hella go. Kuupili. Ha'o. Aloha. Kuule. Kaupo'o hivi. Turn to the side. Smell. Onauna ika ihu. Pretty or handsome? No hea ika maka. That's it. Okay, somebody in the audience is going to say, Kumu, you said that the right hand is on the bottom, but you put the left hand. You're right. Did you catch that? I messed up. Okay. Let's try it with Weldon singing. He has such a beautiful voice. Can we? Okay, here we go. Weldon, thanks for being with us at Hula today. It's lovely to see you. Oh, yeah, I'm good. How's Okay, very good. Let's hear it. kind of a long intro. We'll skip it the next time, but here we go. All of this is just setting the scene. Count, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Kaholo. Side and front. Get ready to sit into that hella. Right hand top. That's it. Put the right hand over the lace. Side, side, shoulders. Fragrance. Smell. Right hand. No hair is beautiful or handsome. That's it. Okay, we're almost so close. We're so close. Okay, so let's take a look at the words just to make sure that we know where we are. So here are the words for Leho Oheno, and we are No Hea Ika Maka. We're right over here. You see where it says No Hea? Then Lili Ko Ika Ua Kilihune. We're talking about this light, light mist. The kilihune, ua kilihune, is a very gentle light mist. And it just sort of um, uh, is like a dew on your skin. Yeah? So after you do, no hea ika maka, you're going to extend the right hand out. And your left hand is going to go, kiliko ika ua. Wait, wait. <laughs> just kidding. It's your left hand that's out left hand your right hand is going to do the little dew sprinkle and then your hand's going to go to this side and then you're going to swish 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 because remember that when you have a dew a very light mist it doesn't come poof, poof, straight down like this it gets carried by the wind the uakilihune is kind of wind and rain together so after you do smell pretty face now that dew Lili ko ika ua, then swish. Kili hu hu ne. You're doing great. Kili pohe ike kani le hua. You're gonna touch by your knuckle, by your shoulder, and you're gonna draw a cross. Then you're gonna pick flower. The kani le hua is the rain that falls on the le hua blossom. You got it? Did I lose you? I think I lost myself, so don't worry about it. Okay, so. Let's go from onau na ika ihu. Left hand is out, right hand is by your nose, turning to the side. Here we go. Onau na ika ihu. Face. No hea ika maka. Then kaholo to the right. Lili ko ika ua kili hu hu ne. Tap, tap. Kili pohe ke kani an le hua. Now you're going to turn to this side. Le hua. Oh, yeah. See what? We turn on the wrong side. The le hua goes to the left. Then we have two kaos. Le hua kaholo. Okay, then we get back to hella. E, okay, let's let him sing because he's much better at this than I am. Thanks for being here, everybody. It's lovely to see the numbers. It's, it's a good bunch of you. What happened? You all invited a friend. Good job. That's what I said to do. You ready? Long intro. Yeah. So left foot is planted, right foot is out, ready to roll. Get ready. Bula mai. Sit down into the hella. My stuck low. Right hand on top. Ha o. Way. Put on that lay. Right hand goes up. To your right shoulder. And then left. Turning to the side. Oh, no, no, fragrance. 
no hands, your face, no that dewiness carried by the wind. Tap, tap, cross, pick the lehua. There's two extra ka'o here. Ka follow, just like the beginning. Okay, second chance. Eko upili hella. Ka'o, bring it in. Little tug. Follow the hand. Look over the right and left. Now. Pretty face. Misty rain that dews the skin. Tap, tap. Turn side. Ka'o. One and two. Ah, that's good. Okay. Now I know you're very eager to practice this one million times before your video is due um, later this month. So I want to finish the whole thing today. I know it feels insane to learn an entire hula in one day, but the replay of this video will be available immediately. So if it's not already midnight um, and you have to go to sleep, you could watch it for one whole more hour. Just practice it over and over and over. And I would love that because my view count would just go pew. Okay, so do it. Um, let's go over the ending part before we run out of time. So we've made it all the way to Kanile Hua. Okay, so we're right here by Vevelo. Really only three more lines left. You've got this. So Velo, we have talked about before. Velo is sort of this waving flapping motion like when you look at a flag on a flag pole that is velo velo anaikahai hawaii have you folks heard that song kalele onalani anyways that is that that sort of um flapping and being on display right in the wind and proud okay so vevelo ke aloha means my love is for everyone to see on display I'm not hiding my love. It's for everyone to know how much I love. Everybody knows, right? Did you miss the memo? I love him so much. So in case you didn't know, Vevelo Kealoha for Luke right over there. So Vevelo Kealoha, after you're here, Ka'o Ka'o, it's very simply going to streak across the sky. Yeah? Think about the airplane flying that flapping banner in the back, and it says, I love you, Luke. Okay, that's what it says. Or whoever. Hopefully you don't love Luke. Maybe get somebody of your own. Okay. So, Vevelo ke aloha. It's going to stream. Vevelo ke aloha. You're going to reach out. Ke aloha. And you're going to look over your left shoulder. Okay, so love motion right here. Nice and close. Okay, so go from up above your head. Hands are parallel. Vevelo. Then love motion. Ke aloha. Ika onohi. Onohi means eyeball. It's kind of graphic to think of, but in my sight. It, as far as I can see, my love is, you know, on display. That's what we're saying. For this in ika onohi, your right hand is going to touch right from your, what is this called? Eyebrow. <laughs> Long day, guys. Okay, your eyebrow out, arcing out. And then arcing back, and then a little flip, lift the pinky. No, don't, don't lift it. Just right like that, okay? So out, arc, and back, and flip. Okay, so that's the eyeball motion. Let's go from vevelo, vevelo, love motion. Ke aloha, eyeball. Ika onohi. That's it. Ume ume is this feeling, you know, when you have like butterflies in your stomach or just this kind of whoosh of emotion. That's what ume ume is. Your hands are going to do this motion. Scoop and scoop. Okay, try not to get too flappy with the elbows. Ume ume, all in the wrist. My. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to scoop from this side, one, and then scoop from this side, and then out and back into your center. Oh, that didn't sound good. Okay, so it's gonna scoop, 
scoop out to the 45 and then into your chest. Ume ume mai ho iko. This desire is for me. Ekahile ho oheno. You already know this one. Put on the lay right hand. Ekahile. This one comes all the way down to the center. Oh, no. Oh my gosh. Pick a key. Kupili. Okay, then we're back to the beginning. This is why we let Weldon sing, not Omo. Okay, so let's do Vevelo Kialoha, just the hands. Streaming love. Ready, go. Vevelo, love motion. Kealoha, eyeball. Ika ono. He flip over ume ume. Ume ume mai ho ika. Oh my gosh. Ekahile. Oh no. Upili. Okay, that's how that part goes. Okay, now feet. Before we run out of time. Ah. Okay. Vevelo is going to be a spin. Now, I know that some of you folks would prefer not to spin. Daijobu desu. Just stay front, okay? You just stay to the front. Don't do this little spin. Um, what that will look like for those of you that are staying front, is just be kaholo right. Ve, ve, lo, and left. Ke, aloha. Still pretty. Really pretty still, okay? Now, if you're going to spin, pretty too, okay? Your right foot. Oh, can I have va, vai, cam? For the va, vai, cam, we can see. For the spin, we're not going to spin like a pirouette. We're actually going to take every step. Right foot out to the front uh, side. Then left foot out to the side. Right foot continues on that line. And then feet come together. Okay, so that's going to be your ve velo kaholo. Let's try one more time. Move it over so you don't trip over the couch. Ready and go right. Ve velo, two, three, tap. Lucky thing, you only have to spin one time because we're going to go to the left regular kaholo. Ke aloha. Then we're going to kaholo forward. Ika ono hi. And back. Okay, you thought I was going to keep coming forward. It was like a lap dance already in your living room. Okay, forward and then back. There's always yin and yang. One more time, just a vavai cam, and then we're going to try an overhead cam. Okay, ready? Get ready to spin or stay front, whatever. You choose your own adventure. Ready and spin. Ve ve lo holo to the left. Ke aloha. Imua, forward. Ika ohi. Very good. Okay, let's try. We have one more camera. Set it up. Might as well use it. This is camera three. So for Vevelo, we're going to spin around, side, and then forward, back. Okay, ready? Just a beat. Ready? And here we go to the right. Vevelo. Ke aloha. Forward, right. Ika no hi. That's it. Okay. I'm looking in this and realize you can see all my junk that I put on the side. But did you see my costume? Okay, anyways. Okay, let's add the feet. Come back. Vevelo. Your weight is on your left foot. Let me come here so you can see. Weight is on the left foot. We're getting ready to go to the right. Ready and go. Vevelo. Love motion. Ke aloha. Eyeball forward. Ika no. Ume ume ka holo right. Ume ume. It is desire for me. Ho ika. This is all ka holo out. Ika hile. Ho he. No, I'm fired. Okay. Well then, we need some help. Well then, help us out. Okay. Oh sure, sis. Anytime. Where you want to start? The velo shoots. Let's hit it. Vevelo, que aloha, follow forward, and back, ume ume, pull up by the side, ume, ume, this desire is for me, ika, a lay to wear ikahile, and cherish, back to the top, upili oh, hella no, sit right down, upili, you're stuck, aloha. aloha. On that leg, wear on your shoulders, proudly. Oh, no, no, fragrance. That rain that's pushing. Hilly, 
Top, top, turn to the side. Pick le hua. The velo's coming again. Going around. Follow around. Love motion. Follow to the left. Onohi. Eyeball out. And back. Ume, ume. This is higher. It's for me. A lay to wear and cherish. From your chest out. Echo kilise down. Ha'o, right hand over the thumb. Put that right hand overhead. Shoulder, shoulder. Turn to the side. Oh, no, no, no. No hair face. Do we miss? Tap, tap, kilipohe. Turn to the side. Forward on the right hand, put on your lay over your head just like the beginning, and then back and show it off and down. Yay! Okay, I know I didn't teach you the ending, but it's all stuff that you already know. So you you got it. Okay, you're gonna do all the vivelos, all the eho pilis back and forth, back and forth. Then at the very end, you get do 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 vamp do 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 vamp and then all you're gonna do with your feet you're gonna step forward and back and then you're done with the feet they just stay there okay then all you're doing with the hands put on your lay show it off and now you may look at me that's how it ends so simple right Seems a little abrupt when you just break it down like that, but it's pretty. Okay. Ah, how are we doing on time? Okay. I think we have time. Well, then we have time. We said we got time. We're going to do one more time all the way through. This is, your, this is your review, and I hope that you'll consider doing this mele with us for our Lady Hoike. It's actually quite simple. Just boom, boom, boom. Repeat a couple parts over and over, and you got it. Okay? No be scared of just go. Okay, well then, we are Mako Ko to dance Leho Oheno with you. Once the rhythm starts, we're going to add. Maholo. Here we go. E kuupili, hala down. E kuupili, ha'o. Aloha. Put that right hand up. Ule, your shoulders. Oh, now, now, fragrance. Oh, now, now, no hea, beautiful face. No hea, ika maka. Do we miss? Lili ko ika ua. Wind blown rain. Kili hua. Kili pohe tap tap. Kili pohe. Turn to the side. Lehua. Hold it here for two ka'o. Look beyond the hands for a bow. Once again, e ku'upili. Hello, sir. Ka'o. Pull it in. Little resistance there is good. Shoulder, shoulder. Oh, na una. Fragrance. Beautiful face. Do we miss the skin? Switch. One, two, three. Tap, tap. Cross. Ha'o, hold it. Vevelo, get ready to spin. Vevelo. Ke aloha, love motion. Ke aloha. Onohi, in my sight. And back. Ume, ume, this desire. Is mine to wear as a lay. Carry. Okay, hello. Put that lay on overhead. Shoulder, shoulder. Oh, now, now. Fragrant. 
long ending well then you really stretched it out there sheesh <laughs> anyway <laughs> i hope that was good for you i hope you enjoyed that i'm really so thankful for all of you being here with us and learning this melee it is one that we have enjoyed over the years and um, that we're so happy that we can share with all of you and um i really do love seeing you dance this all over the world even if you decide you would not like to be a part of our Lay Day Ho'ike Extravaganza, I would love to just see you dancing this because we've had people submitting videos from all around the world, Mexico, Germany, and New York, and right here in the island. And it just helps us to feel a little bit closer together during these difficult times when we would love to be together, but it's, it's just... You know, this is this is where we are. This is what we have. So, I think that's all we have for today. Just to give you a little heads up about what's coming Saturdays, we are learning a dance called Lei Hua Kenny Kenny, um, and that one will take us through the entire month of May. Oh, sorry, April. What month is it? April. So on Saturdays we're doing that melee, and we'll do two verses each week. Um, and that one goes a little bit slower, and we're not dancing that one for the show, the Lay Day show. So if you just want to learn something for fun, please come back to this class, but also come to Saturdays. It goes slightly um, different play pace because it's more Ohana-based. Okay? I think that is all that I have for you folks. Um, I would love to see those Lays for Days posts, and don't forget, you have homework. Go fill out that form at tinyurl.com slash layday2021. And yeah, I hope that many of you will decide to join us. Until next time, take care. Ahui ho.